Yo, what is good, YouTube? Maddie Dubs here, back with another video, guys. We have some breaking news coming out of Boston. The Celtics are making a trade and are acquiring a stretch big man from the OKC Thunder, Mike Muscala. And guys, I actually think this is a really good trade here for Boston. Before I tell you guys why, make sure you guys smash that like button, subscribe if you're new, and join the family. We are a big Celtics channel, so make sure you guys turn on post notifications and you'll be notified every time a move happens. But without any further ado, let's get right into the video. So Mike, Mus M Mike Muscala coming over here from the Thunder is a really underrated player. He's been in OKC pretty much his whole entire career. And what he does very, very, very well is shoot the ball. And, it, and we all know, guys, we're Celtic fans. We know that the Boston Celtics shoot more threes than any other team in the NBA and we need more depth in the in the big man position. We are rumored to get Kelly Olynyk, Mason Plumlee, Jakob Pertl. That didn't happen, and that's okay. We are probably going to give up way too much in any of those deals. Guys, we're giving up Justin Jackson, a guy who played garbage minutes, if that. And then two second-round picks to acquire Mike Muscala. The guy's only playing 14 minutes a game this year, but he's also averaging six points a game. 3.1 rebounds and also shooting 44% from the field and 40% from three. We're getting a 40% three-point shooter off the bench for us. Listen, he might not play too much. Like I said in my other videos, he might only play around 8 to 12 minutes a game. But what he does is stretch the floor. And defensively, he can move his feet better than Jakob Pertl. He can move his feet better than Mason Plumlee. He can shoot the ball at a, uh, at a high level. Guys, this is an absolute perfect fit. I know a lot of Boston fans are going to look at this trade and they're going to say, oh, we got a, a borderline bench guy who doesn't really do much. No, it, that's not right. That is not right. Mike Muscala does a lot more. He can stretch the floor. He's going to spread the floor for everybody. When you have guys like Jalen Brown, Jason Tatum, and Derek White Brogdon driving into the paint and you have our big man, our big man, not Luke Cornett. Not Rob Williams. Those guys get stuck in the paint because they re really can't stretch the floor well. But no, Mike Muscala can actually shoot the ball at a good level. They can't leave him open. If you leave him open, as you see in these highlights, leave him open, you're going to pay. Leave him open, you're going to pay. And that's just another threat, man. I, I love this. I love what Brad Stevens is doing here. This is a perfect trade. I don't know. I, don't, I, I really don't know what to say. Let me know in the comment section down below how you feel about this trade. I know it's nothing crazy, and he's not going to come in and average 20 points a night or even 10 points a night. Um, but he's going to be able to stretch the floor, and he's going to be another option as a big man. You know, everyone wanted a big man at the deadline. They wanted, like I said, a Kelly Olynyk or a Jakob Pertl or a Rashawn Holmes. They wanted someone who could come in and be a paint threat. But I think this is actually better in terms of shooting ability in terms of the way he can move his feet defensively and cover guys one through listen he's not the best defender he's not going to be able to guard Kyrie Irving or um Devin Booker or any of those guys but he does a better job guarding guards than someone like a Yaka Perto or like a Mason Plumlee this guy can actually move his feet he is getting up there in age he didn't cost much I think this is a big time W trade by the Celtics let me know in the comment section down below how you felt about it but personally I think this is really good I also think the Celtics should go out and make a, a or not a trade but maybe a, a someone at the bio market Terrence Ross or Jay Crowder if someone gets bought out I would jump on a wing for real but I do like this move here for Boston